Hey what guys, how's it going? I'm just going to do an unboxing here of my new Xbox One. Um, I basically got a new one because my old one broke. And I won't really go into that, but I was just really disappointed that it broke because I only had it for like 14 months. So I know nothing else I could really do apart from get it repaired. And most likely I'd spend quite a bit of money sending it off to get repaired without a warranty. And um, what I might do is just sell it, sell it on you know for spare parts and try and recoup some of the money that I've spent on this new one this cost £240 from eBay but on the shop2.net site I ordered it yesterday morning and it come today so I'm really happy with uh, the delivery and the service so I'm going to get into the box itself obviously this one is just a plain Xbox One without the Kinect I've already got the Kinect which I don't use and I might be selling that as well so let's get into the box itself Just made a bit of a start. So I don't want to rip into it too much. The other Xbox I had was the one that come with uh, Titanfall. So it was the Titanfall box. Get some post time in there. There's some accessories in there. The Xbox One itself, which is well protected with polystyrene and the cover. Okay. I'll put stuff in box there. Right. You've got to be careful. I mean, I'd advise anybody. You know, if you're getting an Xbox and don't rip into the box or if you get a PlayStation 4 or whatever, don't savage the box, try and keep it as neat as possible in case you need to send anything back or sell it on. The box has got so much value these days, you know, people want it with a box for whatever reason that is. I would prefer it to come with a box anyway. Right. So here's the Xbox One here. Looks exactly like the other one. I'm going to be keep. I don't know if that's got any protection on it, and it has on there. What I might do with this one is get a vinyl skin so it protects it from getting scratched and looking a bit nasty. Might try and look into um, getting maybe a Chelsea one, you know, because I'm a Chelsea fan, don't judge me, or maybe some sort of a movie or a game that I like, you know, the vinyl skin. So that's that anyway, it looks cool. Don't look like it's been damaged in there, uh, you know, shipping. So let's get into the box of accessories. Okay. So we've got the, you know, the power cable there. I think that is it anyway. What's it, HDMI? Yeah, is that HDMI? Oh yeah. Like right, the power cable there. Headset, which I'll be giving to me, brother, and the controller. So there's the, you know, power the cable, HDMI, and the headset. And do you know what? The Xbox One headset, you know, the one I got 14 months ago with the original Xbox that I got, has lasted me well. The quality is amazing, crisp, you know, crystal clear, crisp sound. So I've got no complaints about the headset. It's the best one I've ever had with any console. That's obviously the controller. Yeah, and I've, I always I always hear these PlayStation guys complaining about the controller, the Xbox One controller. I mean, I don't know what they're talking about. The controller is amazing, in my opinion. You know, I just want to complain about anything I can. Nothing wrong with the controller at all. Two batteries there, Duracell, so they'll come in under. They'll last me a long time. Because normally I'm using the old one pound uh, Poundland Kodak batteries. So there's the controller, looks nice. But I'll be using my old one and probably selling this one on. So I'll be wrapping it back up in this anyway. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching my video. I just thought I'd do you know this video for my channel. You know, and um, hopefully it gets a few views. And f feel free to add me on Xbox Live itself. 
the gamer tag is recycled bin. And I play a variety of games online. I've been playing a lot of Destiny recently. I always like playing FIFA. And there'll be some other games I'll be playing soon anyway. So thanks for watching and take care.